And Stacy is here from Charleston Animal Society once again, and she has a magnificent specimen of southern doghood with her today mm. yes, southern does. doghood that's right. that's right this is this dog is all south wow. right here what a beautiful dog what is, is what kelsey. is kelsey 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 the bloodhound and she looks to be a full-blooded bloodhound as far as we know she is She's um, about five months old, so she still has some growing to do. She's already about 53 pounds. Look at the she feet looks on this dog. slender, but she has a lot of weight and muscle behind her because she's pretty tall. Um, wow. But she'll keep growing for sure. How do you end up with a bloodhound at the Charleston Animal Society? Well, her owner surrendered her, um, claiming that they didn't have enough time, and I'm assuming they didn't have time for training. Mm. She will require some of that. You know, she's very much a puppy. Wow. But, you know, we have those training classes at the Charleston Animal Society, which go perfectly. Look when you at get her. A, a new dog. She's magnificent. I mean, she is a perfect specimen of a, she, a bloodhound. Yeah, yeah. She's gorgeous. She's got those sad-looking droopy eyes and those mm -hmm. ears. Long magnificent ears. silk ears. She and definitely has the, the howl of the hound. Does she? I've heard it a few times. And that, you yeah. say that's when she's alone? It's when you leave her. She's very sad that you left. But she, she stops after a few minutes. So she's at the age where you could still train her oh, uh, yeah. to do whatever yeah. bloodhounds are trained to do. Yeah, she um, will walk you because yeah. she likes to sniff everything, as you can imagine. <laughs> she is tracking everything that has ever walked on the sidewalk before her. Um, so it's kind of entertaining to watch, actually. Perfectly <laughs> healthy and snip, oh, yeah. clipped, and chipped and ready to go. Absolutely. She is all set. She just got spayed last week, so she's wow. She's good to go. And what did you say her name was? Kelsey. Kelsey. Hi, beautiful. I know. Kelsey. She Look at her. She is she's magnificent. Wonderful like, are you dog. talking about me? I don't know how the, an animal like that ends up. Abandoned. I, I, I don't know either, but I know that we're going to find a good person. Oh, yeah. She's, just she's not going to last long because she she's is adorable. the perfect bloodhound. She's great. She Absolutely. looks like she needs one of those hats and a pipe. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> she looks like, like a like movie character. Yeah, yeah. Those cartoons Look at her uh -huh. sitting there, so sweet. She's oh, for a god, come get get boy. Did the uh, uh, did you got numbers on uh, last weekend's uh, pet expo yet? How'd Almost. it go? Almost. Um, Paul's in the park raised almost sixty thousand dollars, so we definitely beat last year's record. Did you really? Awesome. We did. I know. That's awesome. I didn't think we were going to. And the but crowd was great. I mean, it was, it was a, a really big day. crowd. It I think was... it may have been the biggest crowd we've ever had. Yeah. Um, but it was a great day. What weather was I mean, amazing. We couldn't ask for anything better. Yeah. Um, and thanks to Gary for being our MC. It he was, was awesome as always. And a lot of a lot of people showed up. A lot of dogs around the circle when they had the walk. It was oh, awesome. Yeah. It was, they stretched almost the entire circle. Sixty thousand yeah. dollars. Yeah. That's great. It's a good day. Good deal. And yeah. we need to find this young in a home. The, yes. the dog. Yes. A home. <laughs> yeah. Absolutely. I'm good. <laughs> yeah, she's, she's okay. <laughs> if you need more details, charlestonanimalsociety.org, and you can also check them out on Facebook. They have a couple of great pages on there as well.